Hey guys, it's Catherine here from Break Free with EFT and I just want to do a quick video today on uh, Easter because obviously it's Good Friday and there are some celebrations and things that we were normally going to be looking forward to that we're not able to do. And obviously if you have family that you would normally catch up with or maybe there were holidays that you had planned, we're left with a situation we, where we have to actually just stay home and stay isolated. And of course that's for the right reasons, but it doesn't help us actually uh, understand or deal with the emotional impact of that. So I have always celebrated occasions with my family. I have a very nuclear family, just my mum and dad, uh, and obviously my partner and our two children. His parents, are, his mum and grandma live in Adelaide, so unfortunately we, we weren't going to see them. However, they were supposed to come over in a few weeks' time as well, so obviously we're grieving the loss of that. But then on top of, we're also grieving the loss of being able to catch up with my family and have the big celebration that we all look forward to for Easter Sunday. So I wanted just to take you through a really quick tapping round because it's been something that I've been trying to process myself as well and I'm sure that I'm not the only one out there. So if you are grieving the loss of freedom, being able to see family members, catch up with friends and things like that this Easter, maybe give yourself five minutes just to bring about a bit of, uh, of peace and greater calm within yourself and acceptance of the situation. So I want you to think about how you feel the intensity of that feeling around not being able to do what you normally would do uh, at this time of year. And if you can rate the intensity of it out of 10, that'd be great. All right, so we're gonna start tapping. Even though I have this grief over losing my freedom around Easter, and I can't catch up with those that I wanted to, I deeply and completely accept myself. Even though I'm feeling really down and I'm grieving my loss of freedom. I'm feeling really sad that I can't catch up with loved ones. I choose to acknowledge and validate how I feel right now. all of this grief over Easter. All this sadness over the things that I was looking forward to. I'm sad for myself. And I'm sad for my family. All this grief that I'm feeling It feels so surreal. I was really looking forward to doing so many things. And now I'm being forced to reassess my expectations. Part of me doesn't know how to handle that. Maybe I feel like I'm letting my family down or that I'm denying my kids a wonderful experience of the holidays. Or maybe I'm just missing catching up with loved ones. All of this grief that I feel, all this loss of celebration, all this loss of community and family, I wonder if I could think about it in a different way. I wonder if I could take this opportunity to be still and find other ways of reaching out and communicating. I choose to deeply acknowledge the grief that I feel right now. I'm processing this sadness at a cellular level and I'm choosing to look forward to other ways to celebrate. All is not lost. 
It's safe for me to process this feeling right now. And I am deeply safe. Okay, deep breath in and out. Okay, so just tuning into your body and just checking in with the intensity of that initial feeling. Hopefully it's going down for you a little bit. And maybe you've even come up with some ideas or other ways that you can celebrate and be close to your loved ones and family members this Easter. I hope this has been of benefit to you and you found a little bit of relief at least. The more that you do the tapping, the more relief and benefit that you will find. Of course, if you need anything else or you'd like to reach out, please feel free to do so. My website is breakfreewitheft.com. Take care, stay safe and happy Easter. Bye for now.